hello friends very good morning to all of you so today we are going to discuss pf09 that is uh, setup of virtual machines in google cloud so basically like uh, we can just create an account like uh, in gcp right google cloud platform and uh, we'll get uh, uh, 300 dollar free credits that we need to spend in uh, three months that is 90 days so we can just use that and there we can just uh, create a uh, machines like maybe we can just set up like one linux machine one windows machine so in windows machine we can install our ping fit right and on Linux, we can install our ping fed engine node, right? So we can just cover that uh, in the PF10, that is installation of ping fed, right? So in this video, just we'll talk about like how we can set up the, uh, how we can basically create the virtual machines, right? In GCP. So let's begin. Yeah, so let's uh, quickly log into uh, console.cloud.google.com. Let me just log in. First here. Yeah, as you can see right now, I haven't logged into this account, uh, to this console, right? So it's basically talking about that, what I discussed, right? Try Google Cloud with $300 free credits, right? And that is 90 days to spend your credits, no billing during trial, access to Google Cloud product and services. So it's basically they're giving multiple products in that, in that uh, trial version. And uh, whatever you're using, it's just basically spending your uh, amount, like because you're getting some, some amount, right? $300. So uh, as per your utilization of the services, it is going to reduce. And yeah, you can just manage in that three month of period of time. Maybe you can spend all your uh, amount in a, in a month or maybe before that, or you can just take this up to three months and just learn and do and practice and all those things, whatever you, you can just get a good uh, chance to explore GCP also, right? Google cloud platform also like uh, how, how you can create firewall, how you can create VPC, virtual private cloud. And there are lots of, uh, lots of things, right? It's in the, inside the Google cloud. So you can get a chance to explore that also. So if you have some certification, uh, if not, if you can just plan some training also for GCP and then just explore in this time, right? So you can get good insight on GCP and then you can just <coughs> go for that, right? If you are not uh, 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 not having much idea on the cloud site. Okay, so now we can just go for the start free, okay? I just need to log in first, right? So it's just giving me like my email account, okay? That is abhishek dot arts two double one at three gmail dot com. Country is India. Uh, let let me click on agree and continue. So it's talking about step two of two is payment information verification, right? So here, like uh, uh, we just need to give just a second. Create a new pay payment profile and then payment method, right? So let me click on plus one okay profile type is individual okay it's not like organization i'm talking a legal name i can put as a kumar okay street address like we can put something yeah maybe i'll put something no it uh, alpha two town it will be no it uh, pin code we can give something or let me put it correctly like wait or not uh, delta one greater noida town will be greater noida pin code will be something two zero one three zero one just let me confirm the pin code just a second should be same but let me verify. Okay, it should be two zero one three one zero. Currently, I'm not residing, but again, I'm just giving this address. Okay, I'll put this state as UP. Okay, create. Okay, so it says that Abhishek Kumar individual ID, I got some ID, okay, that's fine. Now I need to add a payment method, let me click on plus, so add credit or debit card, okay, right now it's basically free, so I'll just add a credit card, okay, and uh, let me show you how to add that. So let me put my card number, so just give me a second for this. 
okay so i have added my card details okay now let's go for start free so it says that uh, you will be redirected to the vendor space to finish this transaction okay let me click on verify maybe it will just uh, go to my yeah i think yeah so say we have sent a text message with an otp to your registered mobile number okay for paying to your card okay fine so just a second okay i received the otp let me confirm it here just for verification they are deducting 2 rupees right and then it will just allow you to uh, use this so you can google cloud services right uh, for 300 dollar credits okay so let's see it's, it's basically working in the back end so payment information verification is happening i think i received something I receive a message for that okay so what base describes uh, your organization needs so we can say as a uh, business idea startup okay we can say as a startup okay uh, next what brought up to Google Cloud so we can say about learn for okay use a specific board service like EPS builder test find a solution evaluate cloud application development uh, we just came here just for the Google Cloud services, right? So let's mention this. Let's next. What are your interest in doing with Google Cloud? So we can say as a uh, uh, data management, AI, machine learning, storage, backup, game development, virtual machines, hybrid, and all. So we're going to look for the VMs, right? So let's make it that for now. Okay. Next. What best describe your role is? So our role is basically engineer or developer. Okay. Let's get it done. So now basically we are in, so you can see you are in free trial. We have zero out of 25,073 credits used, right? That means basically they have given us $300. That means 25,000 rupees, right? And it's going to expire when? It's 30th of September 2024. It's valid for three months, right? Now you can just use Google Cloud services, whatever services they are providing to you. Like uh, as I told, it's a virtual machine you can create. You can just utilize their database services, APIs, and many other things also, right? You can create firewall rules. You can create virtual private cloud. You can just uh, play around with that, right? So just it will just help you to get more insight on cloud environment. Yeah. So basically, the things are running everywhere. It's like the same as we discussed, right? In the on-premise architecture as well as cloud. So it looks same, but yeah, you need to understand uh, how the things, how you can just build your, um, by your own, right? In, in on-premise, you just need to bring a different, different teams, bring different uh, uh, services, right? Here you are getting everything on a single place. Just utilize all those things and just create your architecture, right? SSO architecture or any kind of architecture, whatever you are planning to build just for your learning, right? Maybe a small kind of architecture, like just you can create some firewall rules, you can create some load balancer and see how the requests are moving, right? All those things you can do a practice here, right? so yeah so this is uh, all about this uh, i think we have now set up our account and uh, yeah so maybe uh, three months is good like maybe uh, i recommend you to just uh, because one month or less than that is enough for you to uh, go through the ping federate thing right you can able to uh, use the different features of ping federate you can just good, get good hands on on ping federate right but if you are if you have left with two months right then I recommend you to just uh, take the basic training quickly from any of the uh, uh, source, right? Whether YouTube or Udemy or anywhere, right? And then quickly jump here for your uh, practical things, right? Just uh, to do some hands-on, uh, which will just give you a very good insight on Google Cloud, right? So, yeah. Okay. Uh, so, this is all about this. And, okay. So, for now, uh, we can just uh, definitely, we need to go for creation of the virtual machines that we can do like... Uh, uh, maybe uh, in in part two right so this is the maybe it, it will be good right we can just create the, uh, the we can just try to sort in the video uh, video length right so that it can easy to uh, watch for the viewers right so let's quickly jump to the next part and we can quickly discuss on the creation of the virtual machines right so till the time thank you